Welcome mate, I'm Bloodthirsty Lord, but you can call me Lordy and today we're going to talk about patch 27.1 Which is the new update that just came out for Paragon or will be coming out in the next day or so But we got the information now so we get to read it, understand it before it's actually out This contains the new hero Chimera, the bug fixes and also the weekly car pack in this latest update So we're going to explain everything within this video, so let's get straight into it So tomorrow at June 21st, we'll be pushing out our update, the 27.1 update And with it, you'll be able to play as Chimera the TLDR on Chimera is that he is a melee fighter who excels at singling out enemies. He's a great duelist which allows him to lock down solo heroes in order to isolate and execute. His unleash ability gives him massive attack speed for a short period of time. His spirit regeneration ability gives him health regen on basic attack. His ability ambush allows him to get close the gap on enemy heroes and lock them down with his ultimate color which roots your targets and pushes their allies away. In addition to this, we have a new weekly card pack. This week's rotation includes Madstone Gem, Hunter's Gill, and Curse of the Leech. So right now we understand all his abilities, or the majority of his abilities, but there's also a little overlook or overview of his abilities down below, so we can go through it as well. And the three cards that we see here, they're pretty decent, nothing too crazy, but they are useful guaranteed, especially that Madstone Gem is very good early item. Stalk your prey with Chimera and emerge victorious. See you on the battlefield. So there we got all the information. So his ability is called Hack. Uh, Kamo swings his axes dealing physical damage, which is pretty much his basic attack. Then his other ability is called Ambush, which was called Pounce or Leap. Kamo leaps to a target enemy hero, briefly stunning that hero and dealing physical damage in a small area around him. And then his other ability called Unleash, Kamo gains max attack speed for the next 5 seconds or 5 attacks, whichever happens first. The card damage scaling of the ability increases with the ability's level. And another ability which is like a passive ability type of thing, so it doesn't have a unique active or any type of active, and that is Spirit Regeneration. Passive, Chimera gains stacks of temporary health regen when he lands basic attacks on an enemy. These stacks last for 5 seconds, and his ultimate, the Cult, which is an amazing ultimate, Chimera selects the enemy hero. After a brief channel, he roots and deals physical damage to that hero. He pushes away and slows all other enemies around him, so that's pretty nice. So the kit looks like a pretty solid kit, and we're gonna have some videos and gameplays of the actual character tomorrow, so guys, get bloody hype when this character's out, because you'll expect some gameplay on my channel. And there you go, it goes over the weekly car packs once again, we're not gonna see that, skip that, we don't care about that. Agora minion spawning audio should play correctly now. The HUD and UI updated piece for Icon fixed that issue where the overhead health bars was default too on, but the UI wasn't fully reflecting that, okay, that's kind of awkward. The performance adjusted LOD distance scaling based on view distance quality to reduce triangle counts further on lowest and low settings. AI fixed bots getting stuck after using movement locking abilities. Fixed a bug that was forcing level 1 players to play against more difficult bots. In co-op, solo versus AI bots should now prefer to pick heroes that not been picked yet on the other team. And then we go through all the heroes. So Chimera has a new skin already which is a T1 skin, pretty much a skin that gets introduced with the character with it and there was no image here but you should be able to see an image on screen right now so that's pretty amazing we got it from the dev stream and pretty much is a white tiger chimera skin and this skin looks gorgeous the base color pretty much is black and red then you got this white blue tiger skin it looks pretty cool and i can't wait to actually get my hands on this and play this in game or play this character just the character is bloody amazing who can actually hate this character it's amazing especially because i'm playing in the jungle and i love jungle this character will suit me so much the next hero is Decker the Slow Bubble. Fix the multiplicative slow that should have been additive. The next hero is Severog. Major VFX optimizations and performance improvements applied to Severog. Sparrow in a fire. Fix the ability damage behaving incorrectly due to the basic attack changes that were not also applied to her modifying basic attack when altered. The next hero is Richter Electrocute. Fix for card scaling being set to scale 5 times more than intended. Fix for ability sometimes applying 6 ticks of damage then rather than 5. And that is pretty much all the stuff that happened in patch 27.1. It's a small patch but we get little little buffs, no, no, no little buffs, little nerfs here and there, little things they needed to add. Pretty much majority of it was bug fixes to be honest. But the biggest thing is that Chimera is in the game in this patch and I can't wait to actually play it myself. And especially that skin, oh my god guys, that skin is bloody gorgeous. It is a T1 skin so it's not crazy amazing but at least it's a good skin to have on the day of release compared to the base model or maybe even the challenger. I haven't seen the challenger yet. I've seen the base model and I've only seen the other one which is the tiger so if the challenger looks pretty nice why not get that as well 
So, mates, that is all for this video. Show your support, smash that like button. Let's try to get 30 likes on this video. And if you guys want to see more Paragon Gaming content on my channel, all you have to do is share this with your friends and hit the subscribe button to become a mate today. So that is all for this video. Oh, time to go, but don't you worry. We'll back very soon. Hey, that's boys. He's answered nothing yet. I can't believe it. There was a white tiger chimera skin, and we got actual footage of it when it wasn't even on their website, man. That is bloody crazy. <laughs> and then it feels right. Oh,